In this video, you'll learn how to enable user and account tracking on your Eftrinsic subscription. And also, you'll learn how to add custom attributes on those user and account objects. Enabling user and account tracking will allow you to gain visibility to your application's usage from your users and accounts with the ability to then engage them in a contextual way to drive growth and increase your product's adoption. Let's begin by creating a product on Eftrinsic. Eftrinsic supports multiple products, but you only need one to find to get started. This creates a unique product key that will be used for the rest of the setup process. If your organization is using segment.com, simply log into your segment.com instance and add Eftrinsic as a destination. It is important to enter the Eftrinsic product key and not the Eftrinsic API key when segment.com asks for any sort of Eftrinsic key. Enable the destination and you are all set. One additional note for you segment.com customers, you'll want to check out the attributes that are configured with your segment.com setup to be sure that they are also defined in the Eftrinsic Attributes page. Okay, if you are not using segment.com, then not to worry, your install is also very easy but you may need some developer assistance. For your installation, you will copy and paste the Eftrinsic tag which contains your product key and add it to the head section of the pages on your web application. Next, you need to add a bit more JavaScript onto your login page. This JavaScript call will identify users as they log into your product. The Eftrinsic identify call can also be used to send additional user and account attributes you would like to use in Eftrinsic. Our docs.eptrinsic.com help pages include a list of all the standard user and account attributes we support out of the box, but rest assured you can also create additional custom attributes if there are fields that you want to also include. Just be sure to define them in the Eptrinsic Attributes page. You can confirm that your installation is complete by logging into Eptrinsic where you should see users flowing into Audience Explorer. Then when you select any user's profile, you can see their recent activity and their user attributes, account attributes, and social data as is automatically augmented for you by Eptrinsic. The user and account attributes should align with those attributes your team is passing in as part of that identify call or from segment.com if you're using segment.com. That is all for now. If you have any questions or issues with your installation, please contact us at support at Thanks for watching.